Hello everyone, Rissy Toothpick here, back again with something new called Wasteland 3. It came out yesterday. We're going to be playing it today. I've never played a Wasteland game in my life. I have watched some of the old Wasteland on YouTube, but we're going to get into it. It's blind. We don't know what we're doing here. And apparently there's giant creatures. We're going to play on the medium or the Wastelander difficulty because I'm no expert. And I guess we went from Arizona to now we're in Colorado, I suppose. It's been a rough few years for the Desert Rangers. When the world ended, they tried to bring some order to what was left of Arizona. But then the Cochise AI woke up and they found themselves in a fight to the death with its robot army. In the end, they had to nuke their own base to kill the damn thing for good. Been hard going ever since. Then, the Rangers heard from a fellow calling himself the Patriarch. Said he owned Colorado, but his kids were trying to steal it from him. And if the Rangers were to come and put him in their place, he'd give Arizona all the food and supplies it needed to rebuild and survive. Whoa, whoa! Sorry, Major. No way we're getting through that. 10-4, Cody. Advance team reported an alternate route across a frozen lake. Find it. Copy that. Well, reluctant as the Rangers are to interfere in family squabbles, they weren't really in a position to say no. Our route's around that dam on the far shore. Scouts, check out the ice and lead us across. Yes, ma'am. So the brass sent Ranger Team November across the Rockies. Because the aid he was promising the Rangers wasn't just their best hope. It was their last. Okay, Major. All good. Come ahead. But that's the thing about the Rangers. It doesn't matter how hard it gets or how many of them fall. They keep on fighting. The Rangers never stop fighting. I feel like the whole family here in Colorado is just bad. <laughs> just kill them all out. Patriarch too. Might as well. Just take over the land. It'd be good to go. We're going to go with the young rangers here. Lovers and rivals since first joining the rangers. Yuri and Spence's competitiveness drives them to excellent and risky dares. Automatic weapons, small arms. They look a little rough, but we're rolling with them. Hold them off, Team November. Keep it shot, but buy me a minute and I think I can get the weapons online. Alright, so I guess we're gonna get this weapon online. Enemy turn. Sergeant Wash is gonna get like smacked here pretty soon. Ooh. Friendly turn. Got some damaging on him. With you, I think all you need to do is put this guy down. Make it easy. 
you have what five AP left. Let's see here, attack, reload. We got plenty of ammo at the moment. Set up an attack that will trigger of the enemy's next turn. Sure. Is it doing ambush? Man, he killed everyone over here, really. I think we need to move over here, though. Yeah, combat movement. Let's see, what type of attack? Do you have anything? A 95? Go for that. Yeah, put him down. Oh, pissed everyone off, apparently. Uh, let's see if we can kill that guy. Oh, not enough AP. That's fine, then. What we're gonna do is we're actually gonna defend, because... You gotta have cover. And they got a big old robot, apparently. They're not messing around today. Oh, had that ambush going. Oh, we can kill this guy next turn. Okay, he's running. Come on, you piece of. There's the problem. Hang in there, November. Almost got it. So probably like one more. Let's see, you, can you heal? Use the destroy 50% of amount healed increase with the first aid skill level. Oh, you healed yourself, huh? <laughs> that, that was not what I wanted, but all right. Let's see here. Let's back up here. 61%. Oh, uh, friendly fire is on. Not what I wanted. <laughs> Oops, we learned something new, too. Apparently, you can kill your buddies. We're better off going for these guys, though. Because the big gun's probably gonna get rid of him. Missed him, apparently. 1 AP. Let us defend. You love killing your buddies, but you defend as well. Because they're going to kill our friends here. Yeah, he's almost dead. In fact, he's dead now. Wow, this warbot is really smacking into my people. November, you have targeting control. This time, to even the odds, left click on the vehicle, use tab to select it, or tab, then attack with the door C warbot to take it out. Yeah, go for that. And that almost killed all of them. You need to move probably just right here, and then put this guy down. Took a little bit of friendly fire there, but we got it done. You two? Come here. Listen, if you want to live through this, we gotta take out the bastards with the rocket launcher up on the dam. Okay. We'll each find our own way up there and catch them front and back. Got it? Pretty simple. There's only two of us, but uh, understood, Major. Good. And remember, Arizona's depending on us. There's no giving up here. There's no going back. All right, move out. Alrighty. Oh, there went a rocket. <laughs> Just like chilling, like almost got him. All right, so I'm assuming we need to go this way. <laughs> Look at them doodle bugs run! Come on, cousins! Don't let them scatter. Keep them together while I reload the rocket gun. Oh, man, I love this thing. You're now controlling a single character. This is useful when setting up before a fight or navigating past the lands, mines, and traps. However, while exploring the world, it's generally better to keep your entire squad together. You can quickly select everyone by pressing space. Basic moving, yeah. She doesn't have anything because I accidentally used it. Because she is a medic, so I thought she would control everyone, but she doesn't. Alright, but anyways, we can move around now. Just kind of see what's around here. Back up a little bit. Oh, we can actually pick up items we have a cigarette but junk but we can probably sell it for a little bit spikes made from rusty nails and powder cartridges it's like 1776 all over again this ammo is used only in the jankiest of homemade weaponry and more junk junk 
around the world in 800,000 days, a thrilling and inspirational tale of a snail's journey to circumnavigate the globe and scrap. Quick slot item, yellow snowball. The right target character to leave them wondering when their life turned wrong. 2% chance to apply the stink, 5% chance to black thaw, 5% chance to apply Denver rot, freezer burn, ice pox. So pretty much somebody with a whole bunch of diseases pissed on some snowball and like <laughs> used it for later. Muscle tissue, old handkerchief, a little bit more tissue and a moldy sock. You know what happened with that sock. Someone got lonely, was like, you know what? I need to please myself and there's a sock. <laughs> and that's how it went. And they are having themselves a really, really good time. This guy's having a good old time, apparently. Okay, we can investigate that corpse. There are powder burns on this ranger's jacket. They were shot at point blank range. Well, I mean, we gotta get probably close to this guy. Kill him. Perfect, you didn't even know what happened. Can you reload too? Oh, fully loaded already. That's fine. We have more range than this guy, so we're able to kind of like shoot him before he notices us. He had some scrap, and he had Colorado dollars. The Patriarch's official currency, his face is on the front of every bill. Oh, fancy. He's actually able to print his own money. Hey, Cooper! Get off the ice! Oh, sad for him. He died. Let's make sure everyone's following us here. Jesus. Behind us. Let's check out this corpse. This ranger was beaten to death. Probably from that guy we just killed. And apparently we want to avoid the eyes. That's a big old no-no, I'm assuming. Someone sliced open this ranger's abdomen and removed his intestines. Judging by the expression that is frozen on his dead face, he was alive when it happened. Ooh. It's not good. Reservation her reservoir trail and dam overlook. CEO, how should I know? Maybe you blew her up already. Liar! I want her head! It's gonna be me who bring it to Jarrett! Where is she? I don't know. I don't know! You're hiding her from me! You're denying me my glory! Get that fucking gun off of me! I don't know! Oh, stupid cow! You're wasting my time! I'm surprised she hasn't killed her. What's the range on this person? I mean, he's in our range, so we can kill him. We got this. Yep. Okay, so with you. Hold on, we need to change like this because I don't want to shoot <laughs> my own people here. Let's just move here to this barrel. And then just shoot. Thanks. I don't think I could have lasted another second. Really did a number on me. I mean, I don't think you've been shot yet. I think you're still alright. Let's take a look at your wounds. First aid one, sure. Thanks. You guys are lifesavers. Got a little experience there. Any other or any other survivors from your squad? Not likely. Most of them burned with our transport. A couple more went under the ice and... Wait, Major Tom. He might have made it. Saw him take off like a bat out of hell after we wrecked. Man, he was like, get the hell out of here. Y'all can all die. I'm running. Don't know if he'll come with you if you find him. He gets pretty spooked, but... Take these. Might get his attention. And then she hands you a pack of cigarettes. Alright, and then, uh, who's Major Tom? Sure. Uh, Major's just his nickname. You can just call him Tom when you find him. Alright, let's get Gotta moving. Catch my wind first. Let me stay here and guard your rear while you 
Take care of the ones around the corner. I feel like she's gonna get ambushed Be and die. Careful. Check these containers. Good luck. A tape from Jody's folks wishing her well on her mission with the Rangers. Rad cuts coupon. Free haircut at Rad Cuts Barber Shop. Can't go wrong with that. Some health, ammo, and pistol rounds. Alrighty, so we found like a little tape there. I'm mean, actually a little crazy on this. I might need to look into and see if we can actually like move around or move the map. It looks like there's some enemies over here. We have a hostage taker's key, a worn key taken from the body of a sadistic Dorsey raider. And then there's a campsite. Looks like Dorsey. Looks like the Dorseys haven't been camped here long. They must have known you were coming. Yeah, I would assume. They're like, hell no. I mean the patriarch, you know, is like, hey, calling some rangers. I need you to put them down. Blood for the deluge. Oh, he's dead. Oh, no! <laughs> Don't worry, crap baby. He won't be grieving long. Murders! Sick fucks! Alright, we can use this probably for an advantage, really. Like, let me move this screen. And then we're gonna take you probably like here. There's an oil tank, but she'd probably die. Ambusher, maybe. Uh. Oh, I wanted to click her. <laughs> He's always shooting. I always shoot my own people here. All right, well we smacked him. Combat started. It's your turn. Taking cover, full cover and half cover, and flanking as well. Let's try to put this guy down. Let's go with her. Out of range, barely. That sucks. But you can kill him. Yeah, he's pissed off about that. Let's move her here. He has one AP left. Let's just uh, prepare. Sure. See what they're gonna do. Got a little bit of damage in on him. He's moving over here with his blade. Uh, he's running all over the place apparently. Let's move her here and shoot him. Then use. I mean, you can probably ambush, right? You might as well. You, on the other hand, you move here, take some cover, and shoot that guy. And you might be able to kill him as well. And this guy's just like walking around now. Polaroid photo. The picture has completely faded, so nostalgic. And a whole bunch of ammo. Injury kit. Designed for surgical treatment and other serious injuries. Used to remove any injuries the target has. And then medical pack. Requires first aid one. Cigarette butts and ammo. Alright, let's look in the bag here. She has... Uh, Spence's hand wraps apparently. Hit chance plus five. And apparently there's a whole bunch of guns you can choose from, I'm assuming here. Could we put technically could we put this here? Yeah, we could. Forge from salvage titanium for a superior mauling experience. 
And then experience bonus. Oh, wow, we got a little bit of everything here. Range damage bonus. Yeah, that's pretty good, actually. Okay, so now let's see here. If we go to... Her, she can take one of these. And she can have the injury kit. On him, on the other hand, he needs a little bit of health. <laughs> yep. Probably both of them do. So we can probably move this one off. Let's get her one as well. Close it. She can heal up. And he can heal up as well. There we go. Perfect. And then he can take a little bit more health if I can find it. We got a hat. He can wear the hat. Actually, kind of looks better on him. He was bald. He ain't bald no more. She has a little bit more health, so we'll give him that. I think we can keep on moving here. Attributes. They haven't leveled up. Skills. Actually, hold on. If we go to skills, we go to her first aid. Healing item effectiveness plus 9%. Healing reviving allies and using healing items required 3 first aid. Or, well, when we get there. And she has emergency response. Which is... I have no idea. Right here. When an ally is down in battle, gain plus 1% combat speed for 2 turns. Oh, okay. Anyway, let's keep on moving here. We need both of them to kind of follow us here. And we're probably going to go talk to this person. I guess she's too scared. She doesn't really want to talk to us. At least I'll die with you. Why didn't you get here sooner? God damn it. You should be thankful we showed up. Look what they did to Joey. He, he's dead. Sorry about your friend, but now we have to save ourselves. Come on, we have to keep moving. Ooh. Uh. Damn right. Gotta get poor Joey back to AC. Our orders are to take the dam. There's no way back across the lake. Our only hope is to press forward. Yeah, let's kind of try to persuade her into it. I don't care. I'm finding a way back. I can't let Joey be buried here. The ground's too cold. Yeah, it's probably a little rock solid as well. Good luck digging that hole. We need you. You can still fight. Are you kidding yourselves? We are done. Just let me go. We can't let these people get away. Get moving or I'll kill you myself. So you're going to help these savages finish this off? Fuck you. We're leaving without you then. We'll be nice. We won't kill her. We don't need you. Do we? Jesus. She really snapped, though. I wonder if we can pick up that gun. I'm a little suspicious of it. Alright, but anyways, let's move over here. This ranger was dragged out of a vehicle, disemboweled, and left to die. A blood loss and cold. Like, that should have frightened you right there. Took your little buddy out and, like, gutted him. Oh. Yep, you're on fire. I see that. He's gonna die from fire. Now, can she use... Yeah, she can use that on an ally. Perfect. That's what I wanted. So yeah, she needs all the, like, medic packs. And there's some guts and stuff there, intestines and whatnot. There's a little chest there. We have the key for that. And we got frag grenades. Ooh. You've looted an item upgrade. Click the inventory button on the HUD or use I to access or, yeah, the inventory. All right. So now, who gets grenades? Upgrading your gear. Choose the ranger by selecting their portrait near the top of the inventory. Then left click and drag the item from your inventory into the character's equipment slot or double click and inst instantly equip it. So, he's got a grenade now. 
Ooh, she's our healer, but she might want some grenades on her. And we can always put the the medic thing back on. Well, actually, you know what? No, we need her as a healer. We have a guy here with plenty of grenades. He doesn't need no health items because we have the medic. And what weapon are you using? A rust bucket 6x7. Alright, this assault rifle is way better. I don't know why we have all these weapons, but we do, so we're going to move with them. She can actually get the shotgun. Weirdly enough, but the range is probably terrible. We're probably better off giving her a... Colt. Old man winner. Old man winner here, gonna put him down. Actually, what ammo does that take? 38. Do we have 38? We have a little bit, okay. Yeah, she can roll with that. Let's draw both of them here. Oh, thank God she didn't die from that. Oh, another gut puppet to my name. You hearing this, Erastus? Oh, you ought to be here. The deluge of blood has begun, and I'm winning, big brother. Okay, so they have a light machine gun turret here. Amy detection, look out, there's a big ass robot ahead. Luckily, it doesn't see you yet. Stay out of its detection range to go unnoticed. You can get the first turn in combat by attacking the enemy before it spots you. However, we cannot stress enough how badly that robot will fuck you up right now. So we want to try to avoid this guy. Oh, there's a computer here. What does that do? This computer display reads Aegis Automated Defense Network, Inner Command. Nerd stuff. Okay, does anyone I know know nerd stuff? I don't think so. I don't think we've leveled up enough to get what we need there. It's probably like weird science or something. Oh no, nerd stuff right there. Yeah, we don't. So your job would probably be to just disable it. Display reads defense network disabled. System authorization required to restart. This guy's done. Then let us take someone here. Draw both of them. Can't see to save my life. And then let us run, like, over here. <laughs> yep, get away from him. And then there's a generator. There's an armor crate. We need a lockpick. No one's got that, unfortunately. Oh, wow, that was... What was that? Some objects in the world are hidden. Each character in your squad has a perception stat that indicates how well they're able to spot hidden objects like alarm traps and secrets. So he got smacked there. We did get an army rifle. I don't even know if it was worth it. She can actually heal him. Because he needs the health. He just got smacked. He might die. Let's go to the generator. You can probably turn that off. Let's open up the door. Alright, unfortunately no one has the ability to pick locks. I'm about to let her follow us here. And we're going to go for this booze box. But we're going to get a little bit close so we don't... Rangers, Prasad here. Took care of the hostiles who jumped me, but, but those bastards are still up there on the dam. I found a spot to hunker down and give you some cover when you get there. But I'm afraid this this will be mostly on you. Good luck. And... <clears throat> Yeah, so we're pretty much on our own. Critical chance. Ooh, 2% and some more junk. We probably already have necklaces on both of them. Hit chance plus 5%. I mean, you can't go wrong with that. And range damage bonus. I mean, he's going to be rolling with the assault rifle. We need to draw her back up towards us here. What is that? Do you look a blood? <laughs> I don't know. And there's a medical crate here. And more medicine. Nitro Spike. Used to revive all incapacitated squad members. 
good to have. There's a door there, ammo box as well. A rocket. You can actually have a rocket launcher in here. I'm not going to be complaining about that. Might be good on that guy. And a rocket fire. Well, uh, I mean, we have to go in there regardless. Oh, there's one guy here. I'm like, man, where are they? Ah, oh, damn it. Looks like we killed them all. Guess the fun's over. He just notices us or what? Wait a minute. Maybe not. Howdy, Hotlander. <laughs> oh, as much fun as it is killing folk long distance. I like it best when the deluge of blood happens up close and personal. You know what I mean? <laughs> The rest is going to be sorry he stayed home. He loves him some entrails. <laughs> yep, so I guess we're going to be killing Jarrett right here. Oh, Melee Comet Plus 2. Well, let's figure out who his buddy is. My big brother. He'd have loved to take a piece out of you. But that's okay. I'll bring him one later. Yep. Uh, we don't even have neither one of those. I think we're going to be fighting here. <laughs> you don't know much, do you? The Dorseys are the harbingers of the deluge, the motherfucking end of the old world, and the beginning of the new. And it all begins here, you little prayer dog. What I do to you, the Dorsey's gonna do to all of Colorado. So squeal all you want. No one's coming to save you. Oh, thank God somebody took care of him for us. Holy shit! They done killed Jared! Oh, right here. Sorry. Never shut up. Heads up, Rangers. More incoming. Well, I'll be honest. I was really afraid of that guy with the rocket launcher, but with him dead, I'm okay. <laughs> Alright, so. There's some enemies with the high ground here. Is that full cover? That is full cover. I'm going to want you to move here. And then 53... 93% chance to hit that guy, apparently. We might have to take that one. Yeah, you can't go wrong with that. Not enough. Oh, he has a grenade as well. But he needs... Not enough AP, yeah. So you can just defend. Just hide, really. You, on the other hand... Mm, he can probably shoot you. That's a problem. But you have a pistol, so... You don't really have a good place to move, really. Maybe we move you here. And then hopefully you don't... Hopefully you're able to like kill that guy, maybe? We'll see, this might not be a good idea. You're definitely not gonna kill him this turn. But you did smack him. And definitely defend. A little bit of damage, nothing too bad. He's dead. Like, he didn't even take cover. Took one of them down, perfect. 53% chance. I mean, you might as well take that shot. Go for that shot. Perfect. With that guy taken care of, we can probably start moving. There's no cover there though. So I'm a little worried. move to her. We're starting to kind of figure it out. Alright, let me look here. And you could hide there. 36% chance. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to really get a shot in on him. I think you can just ambush. But you, on the other hand, you just move here. And just defend. 
Here comes more enemies as well. Oh, rocket launcher. Jeez. He did some damage, or she did. And wow, he really chose to die here. Let's go with her. Let's finish this guy off. And let's move here. And let's take another shot here. Oh, he's done. She must have got like a crit or something. With him now, we can actually kind of move up here. Take that half cover. It's probably the best cover we can get. Yeah, there's some full cover there. We'll go for the full. I don't know how full that is, but... And then we'll just uh, defend. Kind of get down. Oh my. And he's got a knife. Of course he does. Yeah, don't shoot my people here. Okay, what was that 95? Level up, perfect. Then talk to the the major. Your rangers have leveled up. Leveling up grants them extra constitution and skill points to spend on upgrading their skills. At later levels, they'll also gain additional attribute points to upgrade their skills. Use the K or left click on the inventory button, then go to the skills tab. When rangers level up, they earn skill points needed for skill upgrades. Since you've just leveled up, go to the skills tabs and do something there. Alright, leveling up rewards each character with skill points that can be spent to upgrade their existing skills or learn new ones. It only costs a single skill point to increase the skill early on, but the cost goes up at higher levels. Alrighty, so... She's good at brawling, but I kind of want to get her out of that. Now, we can have a brawler. Well, she's a level 2 brawler. Yeah. I don't really want a brawler. I kind of feel like we should keep her with small arms. So, let's do that. What do we get for that one? It doesn't really tell me. Let's go down. And maybe we'll unlock something else here. Sneaky shit. Is that a uh, lock picking? Uh, no, I don't think so. There's lock picking. We do need someone to start working on lock picking. The problem is, is do we want to, do we want her to go that route, or do we want her to keep on going with like first aid? I mean, I think we go one. One into lock picking, because we've already seen some things that would be nice to have lock picking for, and then we're just gonna go with one on first aid. Confirm. Now with this guy, we're gonna give him automatic weapons. Weapon modding, apparently. I kinda want him to have hard ass as well. So he can pretty much like get that, um, when he's talking to some people, he might be able to like get unique things and whatnot. Let's get that actually to three. Confirm that. So when we talk to people, we want to be as him. At least for now. Junk. Uh, human teeth. Apparently you can sell human teeth for about 10 bucks. I don't know what you're going to be doing with it, but there's another crusty sock. And another one. Tax evasion for morons. Yep. And a rocket launcher. We actually got a rocket launcher. You can't go wrong with a rocket launcher now. Let's go get the medicine. It's definitely going to go to her. Let's see here. Is there anything else around here that we want? Ammo box. And our major is actually injured. What is that? Energy cells. Ooh, fancy weaponry. Let's go here to check her out. What do we do? I guess you can only hold on to one at a time, maybe? Yeah, seems to be the case. That's fine. Uh, there's nothing else here. Let us go talk to our major. 
We want to be him. Major Prasad's breath steams from her clenched teeth. Our guts are spilling through her bloody fingers. It's clear to you she's in shock. It's incredible. She's still conscious for nice stage one. Off that jerk's crew. Did you find any other survivors? So we're able to use our health to kind of help her out. Uh, Private Bell, she should be here That's soon. That's a good kid. Thank you. You did well. Now, she closes her eyes, grimacing, then fumbles into her knapsack. Crap! Crap. Oh. I'm, I'm bleeding all over the paperwork. Uh, we need to to head for Colorado Springs, establish a headquarters at Peterson Air Force Base, support the Patriarch, no matter what. And no matter what, Patriarch seems a little evil here. We do that. And the Patriarch sends aid to the Arizona Rangers. We don't. And the Rangers are fucked. And that brings me to the secret orders. How secret? Who else knows about them? Uh, only me. Uh, got them from got them from General Woodson. So General Woodson might be a snake. When we first heard from the Patriarch, General Woodson sent an sent an advance team to Colorado, led by Angela. Death, but they went dark. We have to find them. What do you know about the Patriarch? Mm, not much yet. He's the boss of Colorado. He's rich, and he's willing to share food and supplies with Arizona in exchange for a little firepower. So, so we better not mess this up. We kind of already messed it up a little bit. And then, understood, we'll get it going. Well, who is Angela Death? Part of the Ranger squad that took down base Cochise 20 years ago. Only one who's who's still alive. That's, that's an, a, a, you know, that's something to be proud about. You know, Apocalypse, you've lived 20 years still. Almost died on a mission in California, but, but she found her way home. I can't, can't believe they didn't tell you about her in training. Give me a second catch my breath and we can go major with all due respect you're dying you need to face this like a ranger now whole oh. this will help you may feel a little drowsy put her out of her misery leave her to die let's do first aid all right do it eyes closing oh. <sighs> Warm. Warm. She's gone. Yep. I think I might have killed her. <laughs> Ooh, she has some armor though. And she has a very bad army rifle. Alright, so let's look here. We have armor. Let's give it to this bad boy. And some pants. Now he's geared up, looking very nice. He has a fancy weapon. It's better than what they have. We're going to stop there today, so make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Check out the links below. And then next one, I'm guessing we're going to progress forward. There's actually a mystery or something, but maybe it's just tell me that we're in an area here. Ooh, there's actually a container. Yeah, so hope you enjoyed. I'm just going to run around right here and get this container. Ammo, money... This is another ranger from your convoy. She appears to have suffered the ambush only to be beaten, sliced open, and shot in the head. Probably in that order. But yeah, we're going to stop right here.